Can you give us something that most people don't know about when it comes to lacrosse? Something that people don't know about when it comes to feet and then also business. Okay. So um, feet, there are no two, there are no two feet the same. So most people say, um, you know, if the, there's a saying, if the shoe fits, then wear it. The vast majority of people that I've seen, I, we had over 15,000 clients come through just the clinic, let alone the hospital work and the homeless work and the other stuff that I've done. Um, and I would say it's probably what, 93, 97% don't wear the right size shoes. They don't wear the right size. They don't wear the right shoe for the right occasion. They don't wear the right shoe, size shoe because they're relying on the shop assistant so they don't know their own feet, like which is your longest toe, which is your widest foot, which is your longest foot. So um, so that's one of the things is they, again, as part of know thyself because then you can fit the right shoe. And in business, it's, it's the same thing. Um, it is what literally, what sort of business are you naturally designed to run? And so a lot of people are running it the way someone else did it or stepping in the way someone else did it. And I was listening to a coach the other day who's brilliant and I'm going, um, great. If you get 70% of the world are designed at, at the starting point to do this and he's saying, go and do this. And I was just like, okay, it's an experiment. It's going to be fun, but it's not going to work. So, so again, how are you lined up to do that? And one of the things about lacrosse that I absolutely adore when I look back was when we started, the, the goals were 100 metres, 100 yards apart. And then we had no boundaries. So we literally would be running behind the spectators. So the spectators would be like, watching you and we'd actually you had to chase the ball because there was no boundary so if the ball kept going you just and we literally played lacrosse around the trees like they did in Canada in the wow. in because that's where the sport came from where there are times we went down the hill and the spectators and the rest of the team wouldn't even be able to see you because you're down the hill so <laughs> that, that was such crazy times they have boundaries now it becomes smaller. <laughs> very, very interesting. 